Hey there, it's Anna from For Real. I'm back with another tech-packed video to help you out. Have you ever come across that annoying iPhone lock to owner message? Or maybe you're struggling with the iCloud activation lock? I know how frustrating it can be, but don't worry, I've got your back. Now, I've heard about several services and software that promise to resolve these issues. But let's be honest, not all of them work as they claim. But don't worry, today, we're going to explore some swift activation unlock techniques that are not just better, but also safer and totally free. And guess what? They're quick, guaranteed to work, and can be used for iPhones, iPads, and even Apple Watches. So, get ready to say goodbye to that annoying iCloud owner lock. Let's get into it! This info is only for people who own their devices, but must remember their login details. We're not here to help anyone break the law or mess with stolen stuff. We're all about respecting rules and rights here. Plus, everything in our video sticks to YouTube's community standards. So now that's clear, let's move on. Looking at the world of iCloud Unlock services, there are quite a few options, but not all are created equal. And here's why. If you've ever had an iPhone locked to an owner, you'll know how frustrating it can be. It's like having a car, but not the keys. This is where iCloud Unlock services come into play. The iUnlock app, for example, is an iCloud Unlock service designed to make unlocking your iPhone as simple as possible. It uses advanced tech to bypass the iCloud activation lock. On the flip side, there's the Locked to Owner service. Although it shares similarities with iUnlock app, its uniqueness lies in its approach to unlocking iPhones. Then we got Safe Unlocks another contender that prides itself on its secure methods. Last but definitely not least, Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app is a testament to how far we've come with unlocking services. It uses AI, making the unlocking process as easy as pie, yet as effective as a skilled technician. So, yeah, that's a little backstory on these iCloud Unlock services. You're probably wondering, how do I use these services? Well, stick around because that's what we'll delve into next. But before that, if you're in a first world country, lucky you, the unlock services we've just mentioned are readily available for you to use. But what if you're not? Or perhaps for whatever reason, you'd instead not utilize these services. Don't worry, we've got a solution for you too. We give away 250 unlocks to our unique viewers every week. Yes, you heard that right. Here's what you need to do to be in with a shot. Tap that like button on this video. Remember to subscribe. Finally, leave a comment down below with your phone's model, IMEI, and the country you're from. That's it. Once you complete these three steps, you'll be automatically entered into the draw. So get your phones ready because we're about to unlock a whole world of possibilities together. All right, let's dive right into the instructions. First, open your phone or computer's browser and type in unlockhere.com. This is a cool web app that uses an AI assistant to help unlock any mobile phone restriction. Once on the site, you'll find a friendly AI bot named Nifty. Let Nifty know you need an iCloud unlock by clicking on Activation Lock. Then, you're going to select the device you have. If it's an iPhone, click on iPhone. But don't worry, the iPad and Apple Watch are also available if you need to unlock them instead. Next, you'll need your device's IMEI or serial number. If you're unlocking an iPhone, you'll use the IMEI. Some iPads and Apple Watches also have IMEIs, if they have a SIM card slot or cellular capacity. But if they don't, they'll have a serial number. Where to find these numbers? Easy. Press the sleep button on your locked device, press it again, and tap on the I button at the bottom right. There, you'll see your device info. Remember to input this device information in the next step. It's crucial for the unlocking process. After this, you'll need to enter some basic info. This is just to attach the order to your account. Make sure to use accurate information so you can receive your order confirmation. A little tick box will say you agree to the terms and don't plan on unlocking a stolen device. Give that a check. Remember to solve the quick CAPTCHA. We must ensure you're not a robot. After tapping Start Process, you'll receive an email with a confirmation code. Remember to check your spam or junk folder if you don't see it. Sometimes they like to hide there. Take that confirmation code and hop back over to the Unlock Here website. Enter the code and confirm once more that you're not a robot. And there you have it. Your unlock process has started, and your device will be unlocked soon. As you can see here, we swipe up to see the iPhone locked to owner page. In this part, it really takes time and patience. We wait for the unlock process to activate the phone. And as you can see, we swipe left and wait for a few minutes to activate your iPhone. 
don't worry, it will be worth the wait. You will enjoy your phone once again once it's finally unlocked. So it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Patience is the key here. And there it is. In this part, let's skip all the setup. Don't worry, you can go back to set it all up later. Make sure to check the terms and conditions and skip the rest of the steps and just do it all later on. Now, go to settings and create your own Apple ID. Tap forget password or don't have Apple ID to create a new one. And here, you can just add your personal details to continue. And here's a shortcut to check your device info, making sure that this is legit. And yeah, your device is now fully unlocked and ready to use. But hold on a minute, we're not done yet. Another method is coming up for those who might want a different approach. So stay tuned. Here are some more alternative ways to unlock that pesky iCloud activation lock. But hey, we're talking about legal ways here, okay? First things first, let's answer that question buzzing in your heads. What is an iCloud activation lock? Quick backstory. It's essentially an Apple security feature that stops anyone else from using your Apple device if it's ever lost or stolen. Handy, right? But it's a major pain if you're locked out of your own device or you've bought a device that's still linked to the previous owner's iCloud account. Now, onto the juicy part, how to unlock it correctly. Just follow these steps. If you can, contact the previous owner and ask them to remove the device from their iCloud account. They can do this by visiting iCloud.com find, selecting the device and choosing erase. After that, they just select remove from account. Voila, it's that simple. If contacting the previous owner is a dead end or not an option, your next best friend is Apple support. Call them, explain the situation, and they'll guide you through some steps to establish you as the new rightful owner. This one is critical. If you can provide Apple with proof that you purchased the device legally, they will help you out. This can be a bill, invoice, or receipt that clearly states that you're the new owner. Remember guys, while the internet is flooded with tips and tricks promising quick fixes, avoiding a shady path is super important. Stick with these legal tactics. They might take a tad longer, but at least you won't get into trouble. So, there you go. This was all about legal ways to remove the iCloud activation lock. Stay safe and stay tuned.